Hey guys, what's up, man? This is the bull from the Bulls Garden. How y'all doing? I'm going to be harvesting some blueberries today. I've been looking at these blueberries for the last few days, and I've been noticing that they're all fat and swolled up and all ready to be picked. My northern blueberries have, uh, there's a lot of them are ready to be picked now. So I'm going to go ahead and get down there and get some of these bee picked there so that uh, we can enjoy them in the morning breakfast. So let me go ahead and get some of these guys picked up here. Look at these guys, they just fall right off into your hand. That's when you know, that's when you know they're ready. Yeah. I caught a bird up in here the other day. I don't know how he got in here, but he was trapped in here. Then he was all scared when I was trying to let him out. He was flying, getting all tangled up in there. But uh, we got him out. I just love picking blueberries. And these guys here, they'll be fruiting for a while now, so we'll be harvesting these blueberries for a while. Now you can see now, these are good size blueberries. Nice, fat, juicy blueberries. Starting to fill up my bow. <laughs> Let me get down here. I'm going to have to sit down here in this moist soil here because these guys are hiding on me down here. If you're not growing blueberries, I hope this little harvest that I'm doing here, look at that, bowl's almost, bowl's almost full. And I still got some left here. I hope uh, that uh, this little harvest that I'm doing here with the blueberries will encourage you to get some blueberries planted. I'm glad that bird that got in here the other day, hopefully he wasn't here, and obviously he wasn't in here too long because, you know, he didn't get to put a damage on my blueberries now.
All right, look at that that little ball. It's doing real well. All right, let me uh, get up on the other side there and get the ones on the other side. I'm gonna have to go find that one. I just dropped one. I don't want to lose a one. Get your blueberries, get your blueberries in the ground. And that's, you know, get them in the ground. You know, just a little with a little care, with a little care, you could be harvesting blueberries for many, many years. I'm looking for that blueberry that fell. <laughs> I ain't leaving it behind. Here it is, right here. See him right there? All right. On there, there's a lot on there that are blue, but they're not white where I want them to be yet. Yet. So we'll come back. Oh, wait a minute. There's a few other ones over here. At least one right oh, nice and fat, too. Look at the size of that blueberry. Here's my little harvest, right? Nice, decent harvest of blueberries. I mean, and that was in a quick, in a quick, hot minute. So, there's a couple more in there, but I'm going to be harvesting over the next several days. Every couple days, I'll come out here and I'll harvest now. And... As you can see over here, this one right here, this is the rabbit eye, right? And he's pretty much loaded down with a lot of blueberries, right? And this highland, this, this highland blueberry, it's off the chain. I mean, you, you can see it's just loaded. And as time goes on, those berries will start to get swell. They'll swell up, they'll get nice and fat, and then they'll be ready to be harvested. So, they can take their time. While I'm dealing over here with the uh, northern blueberries, I'll have these for a while, and then we'll, uh, we'll get the rabbit eye, and we'll get the highland blueberries. And then, come fall, we'll be having the raspberries right here. You can see the raspberry are getting big. The plants are starting to get much bigger. I mean, they will, they would, you know, little teeny things like that. Actually, I, all the way, I cut them all the way down to the ground, and uh, you know, they all get big. Now I'm going to get a fall harvest out of these ones here. I'm only looking for that one harvest out of them. I mean, these. I can harvest from these twice a year during during uh, late spring and then in fall or early spring and then in fall but I'm just gonna be harvesting one time I'm gonna cut them down to the ground every year and then just look for that fall harvest out of them all right I'm gonna come back and uh, secure this netting over over this here because I do I do have them 
netted because you know if not you know the birds will come and steal your fruit you know I, I want to enjoy my fruit um, I did plant extras and they're way down there up against the fence down there and they're not gonna get none this year but next year there'll be plenty over there for them to to harvest plus you know they gotta go they have plenty of bugs and other stuff around the garden that they can nibble at and stuff like that but I ain't having to mess with my blueberries now right, so what will happen now over the next several weeks every other day or so I'll come out and I'll harvest a, a bowl like that of blueberries and that'll continue on because remember these these blueberries are gonna ripen at different stages so when I'm finished with the northern blueberries then I'll jump over to either the rabbit eye or the highland blueberry so so we'll be dealing uh, we'll be enjoying those fruits get your blueberries man get your blueberries in the ground get all your fruits in the ground Get your food forest going. You don't need a big plot of land to grow different types of fruits. Put a, a couple blueberries here. Do your uh, ras uh, get some raspberries also, and do some strawberries in, in containers, and plant yourself some other you know goji berries and all that. I mean, there's all kinds of berries that you could be planting in your garden, and it's carefree. I mean, you don't have to. Uh, be out in the garden every day uh, dealing with it. If you ain't ha you don't have the time to deal with the plants, you can put in these um, these fruit trees and fruit bushes, and you can go out and enjoy yourself some organic fruits right straight from your garden. Now it's starting to rain out here right now. It just started pouring out here, I'm, so I'm getting wet here. So I gotta go. Love you guys. Get you growing. Y'all see all that rain? Oh my God. Gotta go.